case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1997, the South Dakota Supreme Court heard the case of Gleason v. Peters, which centered on the liability of public entities for injuries sustained due to their failure to protect an individual or group. The case was brought to the courts by Charles and Ann Gleason on behalf of their son Michael, who was injured at an underage drinking party held on leased property owned by Wayne Huck. The police had received an anonymous tip about the party, but were unable to enter the premises without probable cause. During the party, Michael was attacked and injured by other students, leading the Gleasons to argue that deputies Dave Smith and Brian Dean, as well as Lawrence County, owed a special duty to protect their son and breached this duty by not taking further action. However, the trial court granted summary judgment in favor of the defendants, a decision that was upheld by the appellate court. The South Dakota Supreme Court affirmed the lower court's ruling, stating there was no special duty owed to Michael, and therefore the defendants were not responsible for his injuries. The court's decision was based on the public duty rule, the special duty rule, and a lack of evidence showing that the defendants had breached any duty owed to the Gleasons. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsc.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.